Brian, that last minute of regulation, were you, were you okay with your defense there? Were they making shots or was it something you guys were doing? I think you got to give them credit. I mean, those kids made some tough shots. We came up on them. You know, we were, we were contesting. You know, I think you got to do it over again. Maybe you run another guy at them. Uh, you know, Joe came up to one time and, and gave Palmer a running start. He was trying to pressure. Uh, you know, you have a lead, you don't want to foul. You don't want to give them, a, you know, four-point play. And they made a bunch in a row. You got to give them credit. What do you tell your team after a loss like that? Well, nobody's going to feel sorry for them. And, and they have to understand that we did some really good things in this game. Uh, and we did some things that weren't so good. We had 11 turnovers in the second half, one in the first half. Uh, obviously gave up a bunch of points at the end. But we had a lead. You know, we executed fairly well. Didn't rebound at the start of the game. Rebounded, you know, midway through. Uh, but I thought, you know, we broke down defensively in, in some key situations. Uh, and their, their good players, you know, got going. So you got to learn from it. And you got to move on. But you can't feel sorry for yourself. Probably that last shot, is that exactly how you drew that up? Pretty much. Yeah, the kid made a great play. You know, he recognized it, came pretty good distance to close out. j -Bo's in a tough spot there because, you know, you might want to shot fake him, but you can't because you're not sure how much time's left because it was off a pass. So give, give credit to the, to the defender. I realize the slate gets wiped clean going into postseason, but how hard is this to put behind? You know, we've had tough losses before. You know, we've had a, a, a tremendous season, and it doesn't change what happens next week. You've got to play well, playing against a really good team, whoever it is. Tyler Cook had a rough game against Wisconsin up in Madison. How do you, how do you think he responded tonight? I thought he was really trying. You know, I mean, statistically, it wasn't great. He did get to the free throw line 11 times. That was part of the game plan. Uh, you know, he only went five for 11, but he got nine rebounds. He was in a little bit of foul trouble. Uh, I, think, I think it was a step in the right direction for him. Luca Garza has been averaging seven points over the last eight games, comes out, has 25. What, what do you think of his performance? And I thought he was can... great. You know, we wanted to go to him. We went to him, and he was, he was tremendous today. I'm thrilled with not only his efficiency inside, but the way he shot free throws. He got on the glass, five offensive rebounds. We really needed it. Anything else, guys? How do you look at 10 and 10? In this league, it's tremendous. Okay, thanks, Coach. Thank you. Yep.